Clover Health Stock Short Squeeze Analysis and Update. Okay, guys, so here are the first video I'm publishing on this channel about Clover Health, ticker symbol CLOV. So if you guys have been following me on Twitter, you know that I posted a tweet where I entered my position at $19 and uh, 20 one cent on clover health and the reason i did this was is i saw a massive massive volume uptick on this stock and if we take a look at unusualwhales.com got guys their social tracking we can see that it looks like uh, clov has overtaken blackberry and amc as the most mentioned second most mentioned company on reddit and it is the number one trending uh unusually trending stock in the past two days okay so there's been a lot of attention that's been going towards clov so in this video since i haven't mentioned it before on this channel and i really wish i i, I talked more about it uh previously on monday when the stock ran up on pretty good volume uh, i ran up to, it had 119 million shares traded ran up to 11 so I didn't end up buying the, the spike. Okay, what I did was is I waited for a dip. So I'll show you guys how I entered this stock, how I played it. So as you can see here, I saw it run up huge in the in the morning, and then I waited for a small pullback. Okay, so when it pulled back to like around $19, $19.20, I entered my position right here. And the reason I waited is because I knew that you know a stock isn't gonna go all the way up, right? So if I use the analogy where it's like you're running up a flight of stairs or running around a track you can't go full speed 100 percent of the time you have to take a breather so when the stock took a breather i knew that there was a lot more momentum in the in the play so i entered my position here i like to buy on um, dips not rips so now we're at around uh, 23 dollars and 80 cents so in this video we're going to talk okay we're going to do a bit of a fundamental uh review because i like to know understand what i'm buying uh when i Purchase stock. We're going to talk about the short interest and wrap things up. So, if you guys enjoy my content, please smash the like button so more people can see this. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm. And smash the red subscribe button as well because we're going to be covering more of these videos that are getting a lot of social media interest. Because when it's getting a lot of social media interest, that translates into buyer buying power, and buying power translates into higher stock prices. So, let's get right into the video, guys. So, to close out today, the stock was up 85%. 85 percent so this is a very similar move that we saw with amc trading at 735 million shares guys at a nine billion dollar market cap ridiculous numbers so as i mentioned before we can see there's been a ton of social media interest and it's been for good reasons and that's because the short interest on this stock is ridiculously high so clov has a 44 percent short interest one of the highest short interests on the entire market and on the latest day we can see that the short shorts borrowed 4.1 million shares with a net change of 3.3 million shares now guys it's really a shame that this stock is being shorted anyway because this company is basically helping to provide affordable health care for senior citizens so if we take a look at the latest quarterly report we can see that this company in uh did in q1 they did just under around 200 million dollars in revenue and their whole mo is to basically provide affordable health care to americans and as you can see here they are currently providing uh health care to 130,000 um americans so as you guys probably know if you guys are from the united states you know that the health care situation can be absolutely disastrous for senior citizens and it can almost be not affordable where the older you get like you're basically going bankrupt based on your medical bills so this company is using technology to basically help senior citizens uh, basically afford you know health care in older age and they're doing quite phenomenal jobs as you can see here they did 200 million in revenue in the latest quarter generated 48 million in losses but they're growing at a fast clip and the reason why they're growing at a fast clip is is they have a couple of products here they have clover assist they have medicare advantage membership and they have 66,000 people under that alone so i think it's really a shame that the shorts were actually attacking this company because this is actually providing a lot of value to uh, a lot of people and you know this company is hoping to have around two hundred thousand beneficiaries um for their contract so this is a company out here that's really helping people it's really helping senior citizens uh, you know take care of themselves as they as they get older and it's kind of a shame that the shorts are even attacking this type of company anyway because this is one of the reasons why 
A lot of people go bankrupt to medical bills in the United States is because of ridiculously high health care costs. So we had a massive, massive green candle and the RSI is running really, really hot. So, you know, it will probably have a cool off day on Wednesday if we take a look at basically exactly what happened with AMC. So if we quickly go back to AMC's chart after AMC had a massive green candle and a, a, a pullback. So that's what I'm expecting with this stock, although we are up after hours. So I will be riding the momentum a little bit more. OK, if it opens up again big, I will be taking some profits because I'm looking at this RSI from a technical analysis. It's running really, really hot. So I'm thinking uh, we're going to definitely have a, probably a pullback, but massive upside, I think, here. And I don't see any reason why after the pullback, we probably won't hit probably probably will go to around $50 guys because simply you know the short interest is so high and as I mentioned with 44% short interest uh, those shorts they have to cover those shares okay so 44% short interest and 50 million shares out there have been uh, borrowed so they're gonna have to cover these shorts so we could see this stock rocket a lot higher maybe up to a 20 billion dollar market cap or so so I'm setting a, a kind of a price target at around fifty dollars and I will be getting out of some of the position if this RSI goes way way too high because that's just simply unsustainable so I think this is a nice upside guys I would say definitely buy on dips like I said this is just what I'm doing personally I'm up on this position and I will be taking uh, following it a little bit more to give you guys further updates so you guys enjoy my content please smash the like button hit the red subscribe button to receive more video updates from me and if you guys like the the trading platform I'm using here this is Webull desktop if you sign up using the link in the description below you'll get two free stocks using Webull and you guys can use this platform to or you can download the app as well on your phone so that's it. until next time guys take care